did camping today, but it was pouring rain so all weekend actually so we decided to come home a day early and I mean what else to do but to do a project on the camper so this is our first real modification we're going to try and take out that top bunk get a little more light since we don't really use it so be a nice spot for us to just relax um, and not have to climb into that bottom bunk here we go Okay, so the first thing we're doing is taking off the two screws that are under the bottom valance because uh, those are a little bit hidden. We heard that we need to get those out. I guess it this makes you. Okay, they're done at an uneven height, so there's a few I want to do by hand. I don't think I don't think a drill will fit here because it's way low. I like to do this. This is fun. This is fun and I like to do it. I chose to do this all the time because I like it. And it good job. Good job. Okay, so we now have all of the screws undone, including the two that are in that under that valance under there. So I've got hubby under there holding it up, and now we just have to figure out how we're gonna do this. Okay. Alright, so So the, the hold up here is this trim, if we pull straight back towards us, it's going to catch here. I've got to put something behind it because otherwise it's going to shred this, pull it off. But the other problem was if we didn't pull it forward, this edge here back there was going to bump up into the trim up there. So we had to pull it forward towards us, but now I got to go get something to be careful on that part there okay we have started to pull it out we tilted this side up very carefully we are part way through now and we're just going to keep pulling it towards us all right yes thank you very much okay so we got it out with very minimal damage the things to look out for let me sneak in here and show oh there was a little nail here that probably didn't help um so this is what I was talking about. It sits in here so you couldn't push it up before you pushed it this way. So you have to push it forward to get past this and then you could push it up. Um, then the other problem was here, when you, when you go to slide it out, it's inevitably gonna hit this a little bit. So I put in one of those flat paint scrapers in here to help get it over this ridge to get it out. Kind of minimal damage here, I'd say. Um, and you don't want to tilt it too high because then you'll hit the lights. So I think we did a pretty good job. Yeah. Through the door, I can't see. Yep, you're perfect. Okay, we did it. All right, and so this is what it looks like now. I mean, it'll look a lot nicer once we got it made up. Take away all this, reset things, but definitely brighter than before. He's enjoying it already. I have to admit, this was a great idea. Thank you. Mm -hmm. 